everyone, Steph here. I'm the Secret Slob and I am in the middle of my huge spring deep clean. We are on day number eight and just finishing up in zone number four today. So for me, that's all of my bedrooms. Today also marks two weeks since my family and I decided that me and my kids would be self-isolating in order to do our part for the ongoing coronavirus crisis. And so it marks two weeks since I last saw one of my very good friends and the kids last saw their friends. And so we had a bit of a hard day. Also, today is the day that my sister was going to fly here and meet our new baby. And I was really looking forward to that. So these are minor problems in comparison to what's going on in the world, but it's a big deal for me. So I just wanted to check in with you and see how you're doing and how you're coping. And do you find the routines are helping you get through the day? Do you find that the 15 minutes every day gives you kind of just a task to shoot for? I'm really finding that it gives me something, even if I sit in my pajamas all morning like I did today, <laughs> it gives me something to focus on. So I've really appreciated having this zone series and I've really appreciated having you guys here as my accountability and I hope you feel the same about me. Always reach out in the comments. I love to see how you're doing and I will try to write back to as many of you as possible. So for today, it is the last day in zone four. I'm gonna work 15 minutes, here we go. All right, so it's my last day working in zone four for this month and I'm just gonna hustle and try to get as much done as possible. So the last thing in my kids' room that I need to do is clean off these windows and they made these little hearts that we have all stuck up in our windows around town and then you drive around and see everyone's hearts. It's a really sweet project. So I got the windows clean. They're looking way better. There was lots of little fingerprints on them. And when I moved into the baby's room, I figured I would just start with the windows in that room too since I had all the supplies in my hand right then. I actually don't think these windows have ever been cleaned because nobody lived in here until the baby and we always just had the blinds down and basically the door closed so there was still actually some construction mud on the window ledges which is kind of funny. And then dusting was a breeze because like I said nobody's been living in here so there was nothing to keep dusty. We just had a few random toys and sometimes my kids would jump on a bed in here back in the day. But the baby's in here now so we got to keep this room clean for him. To do my dusting today, I'm just using my vinegar water spray. It's one third vinegar, two thirds water, and just a regular old cloth, and I'm just dusting all of the surfaces. I don't really have a reason for that. It was just the one I had for cleaning the windows, so I figured I would just keep going with it. Then I'm getting behind all the furniture, so once again, pulling all the furniture out from the walls, and I am getting a good workout doing this, trying to get it all done before the time is up. And then I'm gonna grab the vacuum and vacuum and mop behind all of this furniture. So this room isn't perfectly tidy as you can see my girls like to play in here and so I do take some of the time during the zone cleaning to just tidy up the room as well. I don't like to tidy beforehand because I feel like that negates the whole 15 minute time limit so I just do it all with the 15 minutes that I have. So here I am vacuuming and mopping behind the furniture and I know I'm going to run out of time but once again I'm not going to stop. I'm just going to get it done since all the furniture is pulled out and it's just easier once I have the vacuum out. All right, so I am not done and I'm a little bit frustrated by this time limit I've put on myself because I just wanna finish this. I have the vacuum out, I have this mop out. So I'm just gonna go for it. I'm gonna get this job done and then I don't have to drag all this stuff out again because it seems really silly to me to redo all of this. So once again, I'm breaking my own rule, going over the time limit, but I don't even care at this point. <laughs> I'm not going to make double work for myself, so I'm getting it done. I hope you were able to get lots done in your sweet dream zone this week, and I will see you next week. We will move into zone number five. Bye. Bye.